we have decided to focus on three verticals which we call we water, we power and we mobility. Our aim in county government is to bring and reduce the distance we walk to get water. I believe this is not the only project that uh, we water will be doing. I want to encourage them with our help because we gave them a letter of no objection. Sometimes some people will come and say, oh, these people came here without our knowledge. No, I want to tell you that before they started this program, we gave them a letter of no objection. And we will continue giving them letters of no objection as long as they will be giving us better services. And we will stand by them as they do that service. The Way2 program is a very great uh, program in this area in Bita because we now get raw water from the lake. Before, uh, the Way2 used to get rain water, which was not very much reliable. But with the lake, we are sure that uh, the community will have water uh, throughout the year in all the seasons. Where it is located also is very near the households. We have around over 1,000 households around uh, this area, which uh, whereby the, the community members now are able to access the uh, the way to water uh, any time and that it is 24 hours. The program is uh, has, is giving a chance for the community members to access safe water. As you know, we have the lake which is very much contaminated, but with the opening or the launch of uh, Way to Today, it has really opened up for the community members to um, improve their health in terms of uh, consumption of safe water. So our water is pumped from the lake and then it comes to one of the tanks uh, outside here. We call it raw water or what people would call uh, dirty water. These are the main filters, they're called ultrafiltration systems. So they're the ones that uh, clean the water to the level that we get, which is very, very clean water, uh, even cleaner than some of the bottled water. So after the water comes from uh, the main filters, it goes through to a carbon filter. This one, what it does is that it removes any tastes or smells that might have remained in the water and maybe some, some uh, impurities. And from that filtration unit, the water is filtered and then taken to the top tank you can see there. So from there, uh, once we have customers coming for, for water at the ATM, uh, at the front of, of, of the hub, the water comes there and then it goes back to the filtration unit uh, for one last filtration and then it, it goes to the customer who is, who is the, the water is dispensed. The client comes with his ID, then we register him where we capture his name, then we take uh, the ID number and the phone number and he signs. After the client has been given this, he comes over to the ATM with one of our staff with this jerry can, then he will decide which tap he wants to, to get the service from. He will position his uh, jerry can, then after that he pushes the button. So in this case I'm going to surf through this uh, hole, so I push this button. Then I present my token. Then after that, 20 liters of water will be delivered from it. This water project is good because first, it's affordable. Second, it's near to our community. Third, it's 24 hours working. And uh, fourth, it's a safe water. So if you get this project, you know we will not have a diarrhea in Typhoid again because we have a, drinking, a safe drinking water for us all.